welcome along to uh, another edition of uh, Balloon Tube with myself, Graham Lee. And uh, this is a, a little advert, really, just to tell you a couple of things. Um, I do run the uh, Balloon Forum, which is balloonchat.co.uk. Over there, there's over 120 step-by-step -step tutorials if you'd like to have a look. Um, we've got um, all the tutorials up on uh, Balloon Tube to have a look at. And um, if you are in the UK and would like to purchase some balloons, uh, we do have an online shop, which is uh, balloonartwholesale.co.uk. Hopefully that'll be coming up here. And um, hopefully balloon chats come up as well for the details there. And uh, if you would like to support us um, a little bit, that would be very much appreciated to keep the uh, balloon tube running and also to keep balloon chat um, online as well. And um, so I've signed up to uh, buy me a coffee forward slash my balloon art and um, there you can, um, if you wish, uh, buy us a coffee or two and it helps us to keep the um, tutorials going. So that's the end of the advert and here we go with the main feature for this month. So it's bye from me. Cheerio becomes the main feature. Quick grow, get out of it. Bye. Welcome along to another edition of a balloon tube and we're going to do the two balloon cat all right with a little scrap for his nose so i better mention that all right so there is a little twirl round and uh so we start off with a um, 260 and leave six fingers uninflated and uh, i'll do a, a three finger bubble so measure that and try to three finger bubble and about one and a half finger bubble for one of his ears uh, another uh, three finger bubble for the top of his head, uh, one and a half finger bubble, his ears about the same size, and uh, another three finger uh, bubble for the side of his head. Uh, and tie the knot around um, this section here. And uh, if you could uh, hit the subscribe or like button down there somewhere, that would be very much appreciated. Tell a few people about Blue Tube. So we end up like this. Uh, I then find, um, squeeze the air, a six finger bubble, and uh, we're going to do two pinch twists now for his, um, to look like his feet, his paws. So I, I do a, a two finger bubble, squeeze the air, another two finger bubble, twist these two together. And this goes over the top, and that gives me my two um, pinch twists. You can do it single if you like, you know, one pinch twist and the other, but I prefer to do it this way. Another six finger bubble back up to here. Uh, now when I do this and uh, put that into uh, that position there, I do like to get hold of the knot and pull that down. <laughs> so if I get up, you know, I'm to get it to the camera. So I'm pulling this knot down and I wrap that one in. It just holds the legs and the head all together nice, tight and secure. All right, then uh, squeeze the air down and then we come down with another um, six finger bubble. A one finger uh, pinch twist. And uh, you need uh, two, uh, three finger bubbles. And that, that's gonna go into the, uh, the pinch twist there. And another three finger bubble there. And that will go around uh, the, the one finger pinch twist at the back. There we go. And uh, I think I forgot to tell you to pre-stretch your 260. All right, so uh, just makes it a bit longer so that we've got enough fur uh, on, uh, on the ballooning so that you have a nice little towel as well. So you end up like this, all right? And then um, I'm using um, ivory. You can use white, but um, I, oh, just put that. I wasn't quite sure what I was gonna do there. <laughs> I, was getting, I was getting flummoxed. <laughs> That's a word, isn't it? Flummoxed. So I'm using ivory and uh, I've, only, I've left about um, seven or eight fingers uninflated. You're not gonna use it all. You want two one finger pinch twists. Two bubbles. And because uh, they're going to be one finger pinch twist, they need to be a one finger bubble. Hang on, there we go. Right, so uh, twist the knot around this section here, and then take the knot over the top, and that gives you two one finger pinch twists. There we go. Squeeze the air, you need a one and a half finger bubble now, and we're going to pinch twist that. And twist that around, that's going to be the underside of his mouth, and then um, so look like this. I squeeze the air, I have a one finger spacer bubble here. And then squeeze the air, two three finger fold twists. So put your fingers there. You can see that's gonna be a, a three finger fold twist. Squeeze the air again. Another three finger fold twist. I'm gonna do mine by eye. That looks about right, he says. You just slightly adjust it. There you go. <laughs> so we end up to here. All right, now I put this, um, the two fold twists, 
this now goes around the joint between the um, his legs and the, his body and the, the head. Right. So we hold that there nice and tight and get the uh, end of the ivory back around. So get that will, uh, keep that in place. Now you need two three finger bubbles, which is going to sit in the center of the head section. So twist two uh, three finger bubbles. This one goes around the uh, two fold twist again. Yeah. And then uh, these two um, three finger bubbles, push those up in between the center of his head. There we go. And now what we can do, Kind of position a little bit better. Right. Then this, um, the rest of the 260, squeeze the air, and that goes between um, his front, um, his front legs. Right. That gives him a little uh, kind of section. Okay. So that will stick out like this. And then just measure that to this back pinch twist. There you go. And twist that around. And deflate that in your favourite method. Don't use your teeth. It's a terrible habit that. So there we go. And, uh, cut off your excess there. Turn his nose of his muzzle around. So it's looking a little bit like this. Now you've got to twist his um, the pinch. Uh, the pinch. They're not pinch twists yet, are they? We're just going to make a pinch twist. <laughs> so I don't know how big the bubbles here. Try and push the side of the head and the top of the head together because that's just going to make it a little bit more uh, and put that, uh, put that piece to it. So just uh, twist that around a couple of times. All right, so that will like that. And again on this one, you can just push these two together a little bit. There you go. And get hold of that. And just push it around a couple of times. Yeah. Here's our cat. Just going to bring that bubble forward a little bit more. our cat and uh, make sure his towels are pointing upwards like that and then you just need your scrap of um i've used rose um you know pink whatever color you know only a one finger bubble don't do it too tight otherwise it'll end up like a pinch twist all right and then that just goes around the um two one finger bubbles at the top of his uh, mouth here and uh, we can uh, tie that up Good excuse to get rid of both those uh, knots out. And here we have. Oh, put his nose on the uh, top there, and it like this. And uh, that is our cat. All right, just uh, do some artwork. And if you've watched any of my uh, tutorials, you know I'm really good at artwork. <laughs> I'm getting a little bit better, perhaps. And, uh, right, let me see. I'm going to move his nose out of the way a bit. I'm going to put it sideways so I can see if I can get up a little bit. Right. There we go. Lovely. There's one on that side. And on this side. Oh, they look a bit wonky. Never mind. Hopefully, from where you are, you won't see. <laughs> I'm just trying to. I'll, I'll, I'll get away with that. I'll, I'll be here forever in a day, won't it? I'm sure you're better at artwork than uh, mine is. And uh, we'll give him some. Uh, Eyelashes, and uh, there we go. And it's, uh, right, oh, yeah, it's a bit of um, So, anyway, so uh, this is the artwork, and uh, I also do um, some spots here. And then you can put either two or three whiskers either side, so it depends what you um, feel like. Um, I put two on this one, I think I put three on the other one, so uh, you can show you that one to see the difference. Oh, yeah, I put three on that one, so. And then um, I like to use the editing pen just to highlight the eyes a little bit. There we go. Right. So, uh, I'll come forward a little bit so you can see the, um, see the artwork perhaps a little bit. There we go. So uh, I've only put two whiskers on this one. And uh, this one, uh, we've got three. All right, so uh, we'll just give a little twirl for you. All right, thanks very much for watching Balloon Tube. And I hope the cat is of use. And uh, let's get the other one. So it's uh, bye from the cat, and it's bye from me. Cheerio. <laughs>
Bye.